close your eyes and think thoughts of goodwill. Goodwill is a wish for happiness, your own happiness and the happiness of others. We spread goodwill to ourselves to remind us of why we're practicing. We want to find happiness. Everybody is looking for happiness, but we want to find a special kind of happiness, a happiness that doesn't disappoint, a happiness that doesn't change. And that means we also have to look for happiness as harmless, because if our happiness harms other people, they're not going to stand for it. So we try to have goodwill for everybody and take that into consideration every time we say something or do something or think something. Is this going to harm anybody at all? It doesn't mean that we love other people. There are a lot of people out there that are not very lovable. And unfortunately, the Buddha didn't have to love everybody before he gained awakening. He just had to have goodwill. Goodwill translates into compassion for those who are suffering and empathetic joy for those who are happy. But you have to stop and think, what does it mean for people to be happy? They have to be happy because of their actions. They have to act skillfully. So when you're extending thoughts of goodwill to other people, you're basically saying, may they understand the causes for true happiness and be willing and able to act on them. And that's a thought you can have for anyone. Of course, you should also have it for yourself. You have to stop and think, if I really have goodwill for myself, I have to act in ways that are skillful too. And so if you have any resentments of what other people have done in the past, you have to let those resentments go for your own sake. You don't have to ask whether they deserve your goodwill or not. You deserve your goodwill. You can tell yourself that. You want your goodwill so that you can protect yourself from your unskillful thoughts, unskillful words, unskillful actions. So the Buddha's not talking about love. He's talking about basically the wish that other beings be happy. And part of that wish is, may they look after themselves with ease. May I look after myself with ease. In other words, may we learn how to develop within ourselves the causes for true happiness. When you have that thought in mind, then you meditate, try to get the mind into concentration, because you know that if you're going to see your own mind clearly, you have to get it still. Otherwise, it's just like stirring a pot on the stove. You stir and stir and stir, and as you keep on stirring, it's hard to see what the individual ingredients are. But if you let the pot sit, and then you look into it when it's, everything is still, then you can see, oh, there's this, there's the mushrooms, there's the asparagus, there's the whatever. And then you can decide, do you want asparagus in your, in your meal? If not, take it out. If the mushrooms are good, well, encourage them. In other words, if they're skillful thoughts, you want to learn how to encourage them. If they're unskillful thoughts, you want to let them go. We don't just watch things coming and going and accept whatever's coming and going. If something unskillful is coming, you've got to make sure it doesn't take over the mind. If something skillful is not there, you've got to find it. You've got the potential within yourself. You've got to find it and then develop it. So there's work to be done in looking for happiness. It's not just relaxing. It's not just taking your ease. But it's good work. When the Buddha talks about generosity, he talks about virtue, he talks about meditation, these are all good things to do, honorable things to do, things that you can be proud that you're looking for happiness in a way that harms no one at all and actually lifts the level of your mind. So many pleasures in the world pull you down. But the happiness of meditation is a skill that lifts you up. So think these thoughts every day. That gets you in the right frame of mind for living a life that really does lead to your happiness and the happiness of the people around you.